Hi, I'm Dave Sidden, Executive Director here at Wildlife Images, and I'm with our clinic supervisor, Lauren, who's working with two of our newest charges. These are fox squirrels, and the fox squirrels are not native to Oregon. They're an invasive species that was introduced to Oregon back in the 20s with somebody bringing them out as a pet from the East Coast and uh, starting them off up and releasing them in Portland, and they've become a fairly common critter around Oregon now. We've gotten permission now to make these guys into educational ambassadors. So we're handling them much different than we would a normal uh, squirrel in our charge to be rehabilitated. Of course, right now it's a lot of hands-on. We have their holding area in a place where it gets a lot of commotion because we want to make them bulletproof. We want to make them able to come out in front of the public in just about any situation and not be a nervous wreck. One of the things we also introduce is a lot of toys and enrichment. So they get things from like rubber balls and um, you know toilet paper rolls, all sorts of things that we'll introduce into their environment that gives them a place to hide food, make them think, make them work and all that sort of thing. So the fox squirrels that came in, one of these guys was captured by a cat and about 40% of our wild intakes in the springtime are a result of cat caught. And um, so it's one of the things we gotta make sure that people remember next spring when we come to that point, Make sure you keep your cats inside, especially when it's baby season, because they are just deaf on so many animals. I mean, the squirrels, the birds, the reptiles. Uh, cats are just devastating out in the wild, so we want to keep them under control. So anyway, Lauren and the other folks here in the clinic will be working with these fox squirrels for through the whole winter time, and hopefully they'll stay this tame and tractable so that we can have them as educational ambassadors in the in the future. It's nice to have. Uh, a little bit of uh, animals or a few animals that we can handle in any situation and let the public get exposed to them as well. So if you'd like more information about wildlife images, our programs, how to become a volunteer, a donor, maybe put us in your estate planning, anything like that, log on to our website at wildlifeimages.org and you can get all the information you need right there. We'll even tell you something about fox squirrels if you want. So thank you and we'll look forward to seeing you again next time on another episode of Walk in the Wild Side. Hi guys.